Okay, so this might be a very quick video. I'm not entirely sure just yet. What it is, I've had a number of people ask me questions in my last few videos to do with Chrome OS Flex. And a very specific question that's come up is, when you go to install it on a system that's got more than one hard drive, do you get the option to select which drive that you want to install it to? So that's exactly what I'm going to test for here. And believe me, I don't know the answer to this, so you're gonna find out with me right now. So let me explain what's going on here. I am now at the boot prompt here, so I'm able to select all the drives and whatnot on this machine. So I can just show you straight away exactly what's on here. So this first entry up here, this is my Windows boot drive. And hopefully that doesn't get wiped out. However, I've got a backup, which I will show you right now. Now this second entry here, this is a 32 gigabyte SATA SSD, which is ideal for putting this Chrome OS Flex on ideally that's where i want to put it and then here what this entry is this is actually my external ssd which i use to boot from to create disk images so luckily the boot uh, the boot drive up here which is windows is actually backed up as a disk image on here so if i do an inadvertently wipe out my windows drive i've got a backup of it here and the fourth entry here this is my chrome os flex bootable usb stick so what i'm going to do then is select that to boot into it Okay, so just give us a few seconds while I get to the Chrome flash screen here. Okay, right, so I'm now onto the actual boot screen. Now, the only thing is here, I don't know if I had to do a jump cut because I'm doing an external recording to HDMI here just so that we've got really good quality and it just might have been a quick cut there, I'm not entirely sure. However, here we go. So let's do this, get started. Oh, by the way, yeah, this is in 4K at the moment because the machine that it's on is in 4K. So what I'm gonna do is go to install cloud ready two here oh this is gonna be weird right okay so install cloud ready let's go click on install here let me just have a look at this i can't even read it because a second yeah this is telling me about erasing stuff so let's just see what happens after this point this hopefully should give us an option to select one of the drives so let's do install oh dear <laughs> Do you know what? That did not give me any options uh, to do any like selecting for whatever drive I wanted to put it on. Right, what I'm gonna have to do here is just flash through this, okay? Because I've got a feeling it is going to have gone to the boot drive. So this I think has now wiped out my Windows boot disk. Okay, so that's all installed somewhere and I don't know where it's gone just yet. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna power down, boot back up, then I'll start recording back at the boot prompt again and let's work out which destination it's installed to. Okay, quick cut to my video camera because it looks like my HDMI recorder doesn't wanna play ball, but this doesn't look very good. <laughs> what it is, the boot order has now changed and the one at the bottom here, which says this CT500 blah, blah, blah. This is actually my boot drive for Windows and I think that's been wiped out. So let me just click on this and see what happens. Now, if this boots into that Chrome splash screen, then this is really bad. Let's have a look here. Oh, oh, maybe, oh dear. <laughs> right, okay, this has been a bad thing. Okay, so what's happened here? It's uh, Chrome has tried to install itself, well, not try to, it has installed itself onto my Windows boot drive. So just to be clear right now, what we've learned is that you don't get an option as to where to install your Chrome installation to. So if you've got a number of drives in the computer, whether that be two, three, four, whatever, it is just going to select what the computer sees as the first drive and that's by the looks of it, I could be wrong on that. However, I do not recommend that anybody tries to install Chrome OS Flex onto a system that's got more than one drive on because you're gonna probably be very upset. Now I'm just gonna have to get off and then reinstall my disk image that I made before I did this screw up. Anyways, I'm David Harry. Thank you very much for watching this video. Take care and goodbye now.